Ferrari. Guys, we got a lot of interesting stories to talk about. Guys, you know, a lot of things are really trending on social media and we need to talk about them. Ranging from Davido, ranging from Davido to Whiskey, Burner Boy, a lot of other persons talking right now on social media. Or somehow Davido has actually impressed the world, donated about 250 million naira to charity. This was out of the um, donation that was given to him, 200 million naira by friends on his birthday and decided to add about 50 million naira being donated by him to charity right now. David bought a Rose Rose of about 200 and something million naira. Now he is still buying a Lamborghini Aventador, 310 million naira. That is $550,000. That is actually huge. Something comes to mind like, how much are they earning from endorsement deals? Some people will tell you that, man, these guys are into fraud. Yahoo helping polit politicians to launder a lot. But really, platforms are helping out at this point in time a lot of them are earning way enough to buy all of these luxury and fund expensive lifestyles what is your own take about all of these stories i want you to click the subscribe button below or uh, the bell notification icon if you are new to this youtube channel my friends i really appreciate you guys for taking our time sharing my videos across platforms liking it commenting it is a great honor for me to actually present to you we got the likes of davido spending lavish we have the life of burner boy spending lavish uh whiskey they are doing a whole lot of you know kind of spending these guys they don't use other than private jets and that is money some persons are now asking questions. How much are they earning? Are you aware that Whiskey signed endorsement with UBA that cost about a billion naira, not other endorsement like, you know, Pepsi endorsement. We have um, other, you know, bigger endorsement also. Davido just signed with Wema Bank. I don't know the amount yet. He has endorsement with Mattel, you know, drinks, spirit drinks. It has endorsement with a lot of big firms. These guys are streaming millions of, you know, uh, views, streams on platforms like Spotify, YouTube, Audiomark, Boomplay, and other platforms. And they are paid for these streams. Now, are you saying that they don't have the capability or the capacity to earn a lot of money? Let's you know, be real. Let's be real. Let's be real. Let's take it out. Uh, let's be real. You know, uh, you will understand that uh, during the lives of uh, Idris Abdul Karim, uh, when Plantation Boy started, Tony Tetwila, uh Remedies, and all those people those platforms were not available to Nigeria. So they could not earn a lot of money. The lives of Baba Frayo made all interesting music, but could not really fit in um, with these young guys running hard on music. The lives of Two Fists were able to adjust and still earn a lot. What I'm really say, talking about is that uh, if Nigeria government, politicians, you know, um, you know, major industrial players like Otedola Dangote and a lot of people, they need to invest in the entertainment industry, the IT world, and the crypto world. This is where the future lies. This is where the future lies. You need to understand it from this 
point of view right now. We have the likes of David on buying cars worth 300 million naira as if they are buying bicycles. They really earn that money. Those are called internet money. E money. <laughs> e money. Man, I think uh, we have a big industry on our hands right now. That is the entertainment industry because Nigeria is the most populous black nation in the world. We have the markets. All we have to do is to invest and then see results on our investments. Guys, let's find a way to fit in into this world. You that is working a 9-5 job, man, you need to keep another side also somewhere because you really need this uh, at this point in time it's not good to end yourself in a rat race i keep a nine five job but i'm still looking inward to finding a way to earn a lot out of my spare time like weekends invest in youtube video making and other platforms so that I can earn a lot of money from there. What are you really doing? What are you really doing? Start doing something meaningful at this point in time. Start doing something meaningful at this point in time. You know, I'm just like concerned about all of this. At this point in time, the Nigerian government, they are still um, getting involved in the physical market where you have to buy a particular goods. I need photocopier and sell. But they don't want to get involved in the electronic markets, in the crypto markets. They tried launching the Inara or was a failure these young people can really run the country and help nigeria to get out of this mess but are these politicians ready to trust the young people but the only person that has made that statement is the vice president of nigeria in recent time bukola saraki made a statement but they had the opportunities they didn't do any no nothing about that that is quite disturbing to understand. I think our politicians, they need to look inward. We have the population, invest in these young people, and then they liberate you from poverty forever. I love you guys. Keep subscribing, keep supporting through SD, and keep loving out my videos.